Okay, here's an easy mistake to make when you're doing your uh, lectures. And that is when you want to add resources and you add them to a new lecture, but you do not put any content in the lecture. So as you can see, uh, as you can see here, we have this section, we have resources, but it says add content. And because it says add content, it's not ticked here, which means we cannot resubmit for review. I'm almost ready, not, not going to let you. So you have to understand that you need to either have an article or a video in here. The resources are just extra. So in this particular case, we have a description and we have some resources. So what we're going to do, the simplest, easiest way, is to take that and add it as an article. Boom. And then you save it. Now we've got content. See? It's blank. And we're ready to go. Alright, so I'm just going to hit refresh. And as you can see, everything is ticked off. We are ready to resubmit. You're ready to submit your course review. Just hit submit. And there you go. So that's one of the things that's really important. You have to have content in every lecture. It can be an article. It can be a video. It can be a mashup. Uh, if you're wanting to have a, a, a section in your section, if I can put it that way, that's just resources, which is a great idea, then make sure that instead of just putting it in the description that con of what, that re what resources are there, put it also as an article, and then you've got it covered, and you're good to go.